Hey guys, my name is Kat and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm doing um, what's in my pencil case video and I hope you like it. And I have so many like Asian brand products in my pencil case. That's basically because I like to get my pens and pencils back in China. So that's why. And I usually buy the Chinese and Japanese brands because Chinese brands they're not that pricey and their um, like quality is pretty good. And for those Japanese one, I think they have the best best pens and pencils in this world. Yeah, this world. And but they're pricey, so I don't like to buy them a lot, like pens or pencils, because you use you use it up very fast, don't you? So I have like scissors or rulers from them. And for those Korean brands, they're really cute. I like them. Um, I just don't keep them in my pencil case because it takes too much space. I mean, I only have such big pencil case. I don't have that much place to put like fancy things. And I go to school, I need something that's useful, right? Useful guys bring useful things to school. This is the holder in my table desk. It's I got them in China and so these are like I think I bet these are Korean stuff because they are really cute. Oh, I got this in Target and like those are cute I mean but I just don't take them to school I took it back from my school bag um, I have no idea what's in it they might be trash yes might be trash I sometimes forget to throw trash and put them into my pencil case so, alrighty, let's get started! Okay, so first of all, my pencil case, it's this Kipling black pencil case. I think I got it um, during last summer. Uh, the reason I have it, it's, okay, so when I was in middle school, I was really, really, really into the brand of Kipling. And I literally have um, all their different like colors and styles. I have so many of their products anyway. So I still use it because I just like how they look, how they design the things. It's simple but unique. Like it's just like who I am. Unique. Okay, never mind. I mean, that's, there are like two sections here. The first sections and the second sections as you can see. Ooh, money! Okay, so here's the biggest section. Let's see what's there. Whiteout. Um, this is the M and G whiteout. And look, I like unique stuff. It's cute. So yeah, it works, and it's not that pricey. So yeah, why not? Okay, this black Sharpie. The Crayola, I hope that's how you read it. And the color here, oh, it's like, it's just the normal black color. You always need black Sharpie, do you? And this red pen, okay. It's not like the ballpoint pen, but it's a pen. And it's a Chinese brand. It's really not that pricey. It's like six for two dollars, I I bet. And this one works so good. It's like my always favorite pen. I've been using them for a long time. Yeah, the same brand. I have one in black, one in blue, another one in red, another one in blue. I think I just have five of those pens in my pencil case. Yeah, they're really good. Yes, yeah, really good. Highlighter. So this is a two side highlighter, and okay. So this yellow color is like really special. It's really really black, bright, and I normally don't like to use it because I think it's a little bit too shiny. But there are times I need shiny stuff. Yeah. Okay. And this side is like. The mint color. It's like my nail color, isn't it? Yeah. 
this is one of my favorite color highlighter so this is um i'd say it's a uh, Okay, no idea what brand this is. It's a Japanese brand, that's all I know. This one is actually really expensive. I'll say um two bucks probably. Well it's expensive in all my pencils or like in my pencil cases because um the reason why I use it is I started to use it when I was in elementary school and since then I loved it. I just love it so bad I can't even change. And their colors and their quality is just so good. Okay, look at this brownish color. Good, right? If you can get them, definitely go get them. They'll surprise you. They're the best. Uh, same brand, different color. This is the yellow, another yellow one. So let's see it. This, so this one is like really, really shiny here. And this is just the regular yellow color. I mean, yeah, same brand. It's this green color. I think I have all their colors. Yeah, green color. Ooh, ta da. I remember I have their purples, but I have no idea where I put it. Anyway, this one is a real blue. Can you see how this blue and this greenish blue color? Yeah, they're different. I'm a colorful person. I have colorful things in my pencil case. Another highlighter. Okay, I really, really love their design. And I think they have a lot of colors, but I just want a pink one because I don't want the whole pencil case filled with those ugly, ugly. Oh my god, I love you and you're not ugly. Never mind. Okay, this is really unique because do you see how it's transparent in the middle? Yeah, I don't find that anymore um, this time when I went back to China to go to the store. Um, I hope they still have I like it. This just a normal pink color. Pink, I can't speak. Pink color. But it's just unique. I like unique stuff. I see this bluish like marker. It's, it's marker, right? And I actually got a whole set of it last summer. And they're all useless now. And this is the one, only one still works. So I have it in my pen. And this purplish pen. It's this like. Oh god. It's this shimmering one. Can you see it? It's really shimmering. This is like the kind of pen I used when I was in elementary school. You know when you were in elementary school. You like those shimmery colorful stuff. Yeah. I got it um yes last year for my birthday. I mean, yeah, it's cute. It's this Hello Kitty one. I mean, it brings back my elementary history. Oh my god, I miss those days. Really, after my best friends, like one of my best friends, we've been best friends since we were first grade in primary, in first grade in elementary school. Maybe I'll insert a picture of us here somewhere, but yeah. Oh, he doesn't mind. Yeah, it's a he. And I have no idea why I have it. Oh, I remember. Because I lost my ruler two weeks ago. I have no rulers to use, and I'm in my I'm in an algebra 2 class. I have to do graph all the time, so I just have days to use as the ruler. This one. This Toyo paint marker. First of all, I like this because it really works. The only, I think the only one that I don't like is because it leaks. It really leaks. It leaks on your hands. So whenever it leaks, my whole hands are like, go. And this is just a uh, scissor. It's a, another unique product that I have. It's from the Japanese stuff, Muji. And it's like, um, okay, so it doesn't take a lot of place as other scissors though. And it really works. I mean, although you think it's small, it works. And sometimes I cut my hair in class. It has bleed and so bad. I have to use them. I know it sounds weird, but don't judge and don't tell my teachers. Okay. And a ruler. This is 
they're from the same brand I bet and I lost my favorite 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 ruler last last week and I have to use this I mean I like it but I still miss my favorite one okay, let's see Mm -hmm. Ah, that was ugly. And this eraser. Hey, I started not to use those regular rectangle eraser like two or three years ago, cause um when I put those kind of erasers in my pencil case, I just feel like they like they're not organized. I mean, I'm an organized person, and. They make my pencil case actually dirty. I hate that. So I found those things. They look like pens and they're erasers and they last a long time. I mean, I think you can use one for at least seven months. Yeah, why don't I have to use those little ugly rectangle things? And a right sharpie. This is also a Japanese brand. It's Japanese, the zebra. It's a right sharpie. Um, I don't really use red sharpies a lot, but I think it's useful, so I just keep it in. I mean, who knows what you're gonna need. Oh, and those two pencils, my favorite, favorite, favorite pencil, literally. My favorite pencils. Okay, so here's the story about them. Uh, when I was 7th grader or 8th grader, I remember, I got my first pencil like this, and not first pencil, like first this kind of pencil. Okay. And I was doing those math questions and I started to do so good in math, I can't even believe myself. And then there's one day I forgot how I just lost it. And I think the color it was like I think it was this color. Yeah, I think so. And then um I just can't do my math questions anymore. Yeah, weird. And I went to the store and tried to get it. I couldn't find the like exactly the same one, so I got a like a pinky and purple one. I don't remember. I don't really remember. And then I saw it in my work, and then it just doesn't work. So my middle school life, my math sucked, really sucked. So when I came here, came to states, I just brought like tons of those things with me. I like them and they remind me of my old days. Yeah, I like to remember all those old memories. It's like I'm an old person, am I? Okay, so this is a glue stick. It's the Elmer's. I, I think I got it in 99 cents market and I have a flash drive. I just got it um the day before yesterday and I was so surprised when I first got it because can you see like it's a plastic one so it's like super light this is literally the lightest hard drive I've ever ever no flash drive the lightest flash drive I've never seen before and I was just so confused when I first opened I'm like okay is this really a flash drive is it like a motor or something because I don't want to go to the store again and it's a flash drive I haven't started to use it but I hope it works and it's 16 gigabyte. I have those Japanese brand thing. I have no idea what's the name. And so here's the oh oh my god. And here's a oh you paper. Okay. I may use it once in class and I was too too lazy to go to the trash can, so I just threw it in my pencil case. Okay, forgive me. And I have like three pins here. I always keep pins and um like clips in my pencil case before I don't do that anymore. I don't I don't know why I don't do that. Maybe I just wanna stay like more organized, I guess. I don't know. Okay. Earphones you need them every single day. A dollar. A dollar! Why do I have a dollar in my pencil case? I have no idea. Okay, so you may realize that I do have a lot of same, I mean exactly the same products in my pencil case because that's just who I am. Okay, so if I get to use to some, used to, if I get used to use something, I just 
don't change and to like really find something super good um, and basically that's it this is um what's in my pencil case video and if you like it like like it like it do you like it okay if you like it please give a thumb up and subscribe me please because um this is my first video and I don't know if you guys will like it or not I'm trying to um, figure out how to do a YouTube channel so yeah please give me some advice I appreciate really I appreciate okay, so thank you guys for watching see you guys in my next video bye